On this episode of Wisconsin Mobile Detailing, we do another voiceover episode where I do a typical exterior detail of what I would do to a client's car to our show car getting ready for a car show tomorrow. So I'll wash it, I'll uh, paint decontaminate it with a clay bar, and then I'll wax it, and you'll see everything that I do for that. Let me start this video off by mentioning since this is my personal car, it is kept relatively clean even though I drive it often. Sometimes customers' cars are a lot dirtier so they take a bit more effort to detail. We start things off by using some Meguiar's bug and tar remover on the front bumper, grill, hood, and mirrors for these areas are most often the most difficult to clean. This is followed by pre-rinsing the whole car off to get any loose dirt and grime off the car easily. We always start with the wheels first by using some wheel deionizer spray on the wheels which we rinse off after about a minute. This is followed by using our wheel brush and wheel mitt to clean any extra gunk off the wheels and we also clean the wheel wells at this time. If necessary, I will use a brush on the lug nuts and tires, however today that was not needed. While making the rotation around the car, I will stop and clean the tip of the exhaust while I'm at it. After the wheels are cleaned, we start washing the car from the top down using a separate bucket and a wash mitt from what was used from the wheels. All areas of the car get washed at this point, even if they were washed already, except for the wheels. For the paint decontamination, I clay the entire vehicle. On this car in particular, I have to avoid the newly applied vinyl wrap. On a normal car, the whole entire panel is clayed. Claying the car is a very simple upfront process. We use a quick detailer as lubricant and a clay bar to remove embedded particles in the paint.
This car was waxed with Meguiar's Ceramic Spray Wax. We use this on about half of the cars we detail. This wax is a little different in that if it is applied before, you simply spray it all over the car and then rinse it off and it spreads itself. So that's what we did here. This wax gives a great even shine and a good protection. If we don't use this wax, we use a cleaner wax to try to get out little defects in the client's paint and still protect the car. After waxing the car, we must dry the car using large drying towels and a drying agent that adds another layer of protection to the paint. Once the car is dried, I wax the wheels and buff the wax off to give the wheels an extra bit of shine and protection. This is followed by using tire shine to give those tires an extra pop. I then go around and use it on other areas of the car that have faded. Many cars don't actually need this, but this 25 year old car has a lot of faded trim. As you can see, the results speak for themselves and the car looks great. <laughs> 